Well, it's going to land on Gifted County. Is it now? We're donating $1,000 to the Animal Welfare Institute to aid in their mission to improve the treatment of animals everywhere. Please join us in giving at awionline.org. Thank you for being your mythical best. Welcome to the more. Uh, we do have a cooked chicken wing under here. Mm. We're gonna find out what happens to that. Um, we're also going to do something with this sweater, which I'll explain in a second. Yes, and speaking of the Ryman Auditorium, remember, Tickets to see us play live at other auditoriums and theaters and venues across the country, and also have some meet and greets in the months of June, September, and November. All those dates are over at rhettandlinklive.com. So find out where we're gonna be, where we're gonna be, and get tickets. There. Come see us. And uh, if you go to the site and you see that um, you know someone who lives on or near or around one of those cities besides yourself, uh, tell them about the show. So, hey, Rhett and Link, those guys, they're hey, coming. You hey. should get a ticket. Well, it's interesting. One of the things that we that we find is that whenever we show up in a place and we, you know, we kind of uh, experience the town a little bit Meander. on tour. And um, usually on scooter, scooter back. <laughs> but uh, we run into people and I'd say for every 10 fans that we meet, seven out of 10 people who come up to us don't know that there's a show in that town. So spread the word. We're t we talk about it all the time, but uh, you guys should be talking about it too, to your friends, if you know we're coming to a place near you. Uh, shout out to Mythical Society members, Semper Curiosus. Um, this is a s'more, a, a mythical, um, a good mythical more that, how do we come up with, they came up with s'more and I had the society, society, society and more. more. It's very obvious. S'more. <laughs> I was like, what? I know this is obvious. Where, um, Society members, you choose what we're doing. Um, so the options were, Rhett and Link feed each other for the entire more. Rhett and Link wear a two-person sweater. Rhett and Link have to sing their conversation for the whole more. Um, you guys voted for the two-person sweater, which I'm glad, because that's the easiest one, but also so much fun. And you know, you get to do Christmas in the summer. Because as it turns out, the only, um, the most, oh, you're gonna have to slide to the middle. The the only acquirable two person sweaters are Christmas sweaters. Look at that. I've been. I've been. I've been. We both been. I've been. <laughs> nice. I've been naughty. But we're attached, so you saw all my naughty. <laughs> oh gosh. I saw all your nice. Now, what, what are you doing with your left arm? You'll I, figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> Let me move closer to you. There. Oh yeah, let's center that. Stretch a little bit. Oh, that's good. I'm currently touching my left, my right pec. I'm touching my right thigh. I'm currently stroking my own beard. I'm also stroking your beard. Okay, that makes me uncomfortable. Does it smell like Windex? Oh, God. Okay, so. Uh, what happened to the Wang? Uh, we don't have any the, options. What happened to the Huang? Um, I bet you it's still a chicken wing. Man, I wonder. I wonder what's hmm. what's happening. I that bet. Chicken wing. I bet it. This isn't really how two-person uh, sweaters work. It's not. It's not. <laughs> um, we're not conjoined twins. Right. We're just wearing a sweater together. Right. Uh, I think that it um, turned green. I don't know, the brain turned white. I would say white. something not very exciting because it they, wasn't sa they saved it for the more. They were like, ah, throw that one in more. I, I bet it became less tasty. Oh, well, only one way to find out. I'd say it uh, it turned green. I think it turned most things green. Let's go with that. I also think that, it, that the meat kind of came <clears throat> off of the bone. Okay. I'll hold it. You what? You hold it. Okay. It did turn green. Definitely green. So we were right. There's and like fat floating in there. Oh my gosh. It turned it green. Now p pull out the pull out the drumstick. What do you call that part? That's not the drumstick. Flat wing. What'd you say, Matt? There is a term for it. Um, flats. 
Hey, oh, flats. Yeah, that's what they call it. Drumsticks versus flats. Are you a drumstick or a flat man if you had to choose? Like a plate full of one or the other? I honestly go back and forth, but I think if I had to so choose. I don't have a strong preference, but if I had to choose, I pick a flat. You know why? Because you can grab one end of it and completely get all the meat off in one bite. Yeah, you can't do that. that. You can't do that with a uh, drumstick. Um, I would also choose the flat because it's... Really? Here, screw that back on. Let's get it out of here. But I feel nice. like team, team drumstick is probably... Just a quick survey, show of hands, how many people prefer the drumstick? How many people prefer the flat? Uh, yeah, I'd say 60-40 drumstick, team right. drumstick. Kind of even. Uh, I got an idea. Let's take a fortune cookie and see who, without the use of hands, except for putting it in your mouth, can produce the fortune with no cookie falling out of your mouth. Produce the fortune with no cookie falling out of your mouth and no cookie on the fortune? Right. And you, and, but it, so you have to do is get the fortune sticking out and then you can pull it out? Or you have to spit the whole thing out with no you, cookie? You have, to, you have to like, you have to spit it out like a dot matrix printer. Okay. You've got practice, you've, you've done this a couple of times. I discovered some things, so yeah, I do feel like I have an advantage. Three, two. <laughs> it's rolled up, bro. Why does it roll up? It can't be rolled up. Put it back in. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty clean. Here it is. This is rolled up too, man. I chewed mine up. Um, oh my gosh. I totally chewed mine up. Well, I lost. Um, success will be yours at home and in business in the next month. <laughs> I can't even read mine because I thought because I just tried to break it up and keep everything dry, and that made it, I thought I had a new technique, which I didn't. What about the technique? This is cool, you can impress your friends. You just pick up a fortune cookie and crack it, and the cookie falls, but the fortune remains in your fingers. Oh, that's a good idea. I have no idea how to do this, but we're gonna figure it out. Oh, Look, it we, works! We both did it. I, oh. I, I, I kinda had a... Look at that, you, read the, read the fortune. Oh. You will never, Need to worry about a steady income. Take some needed time to relax in the next few days. <laughs> Tell me about it. Okay, let's do that again. Oh man, I didn't end up with a fortune. That one didn't work as well. Can you save all those um, fortune cookie pieces for Enzo because it's his favorite food? He can have them all. Really? Yeah, it's weird. You will obtain your goal if you maintain your course. They, they, these are those weak, like, like political fortunes. They're like just political, the, like a, you, you know, in the sense that like they're not gonna ruffle any feathers. Yeah, this one gonna, says hashtag MAGA. Like a poli <laughs> like a political answer. Weird, isn't that what a that is what a political like? Oh, he gave the political answer, which is no answer at all. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's a that's a that's a pretty. Unusual use of the term political. Not technically incorrect, I don't think. All right, let's do it again. Who asked you? Look at that. That's not very cool. You gotta do one snap and We're then doing you're this. left with a fortune. That's the goal. We're, We're gonna do this. it until this happens. We're doing this for Enzo. Well, we did it the first time. A bold and dashing adventure is in your future. A dashing adventure. Mine said the same thing as another one. All right. That's pretty good. But yeah, but you you had to do a twirl. What you want to do is you you're just want an to pinch. Artist, you you are an artistic person. Let your colors show. Oh, that's an interesting technique. Listen, <laughs> <laughs> these next few days to your friends <laughs> to get answers you seek. Listen. Listen these next few days to your friends to get answers you seek. That now that's a fortune. It's it's like it's it does it's not grammatically structured that well. 
No, you listen to these like next few days. It's like there's a lost in translation friends thing. to get answers you seek. Listen to these next few days. Here you go. Oh, that was awesome. To you? Be prepared to modify your plans. Now that was the only one that's negative. Yeah. Kinda. It's like whatever you've got planned, it ain't gonna work, so be flexible. Okay. Just three more. We're just doing all of them now. Yeah, let's just finish it. Three, two. Ah, that little that little part at the end. I gotta find a better technique. You will soon get something special because of your charm. This is maybe the most specific fortune I've ever read. Three times a week. Treat yourself to dessert. Yours are getting <laughs> yours are getting weird, man. Yours are getting really weird. Yeah. Last one. Remember, three months from this date, good things are in store for you. What? How do these get so specific? I'm saving this one. Three months from this date. Three months from this date. Mark your calendar. Listen, three months from this date, have dessert three times a week. Three months from this date, I will have had 12 times three 36, 36 desserts. desserts. Defeat the hair of defeat with our mythical pomade, available at mythical.store.